Been all right. I was thinking. Okay, drop by for dinner, maybe. Joss has worked up a hankering to cook for the family. Appreciate the invite, Reaper, but gonna have to pass. Another time, maybe. Shame. Joss and me, we cook up a mean stew, you know? Me especially. Don't doubt that at all. It's just, uh, now's not a great time. Sorry. Ah, it's Ooh. all right. But I won't take no for an answer next time. See you around, River. Thank you. 
survivors are in need of rescue. And who but you could save those sworn to protect us? Now, these two little piggies went to market, struck a deal with one of Hansen's men, Dodger. What could go wrong, you think? Correct. Everything. Stella, the fiancé. One of our officers will fill you in. Best of luck. Then. Stella? Something the matter? Get down. Can't get spotted by Dodger's men. Makes you feel better. Listen, this is serious, okay? You don't mess with Dodger's people. Okay, <laughs> sure. Pretty comfy, actually, this. I need your help with my fiance, Bill, and his buddy, Charlie. They're trapped in the building across the street. Hans mentioned they're both NCPD. Both grade-A gonks, too. Sometimes do side gigs around town. Wanted to cut a deal with Dodger, but things obviously went south. Bill called me from inside, said only that, and I quote, it's bad. And if I don't get help, Dodger will paint the walls with their brains. Back when I was a kid, used to see badges deliver packages to the Tigers. Worked out for everyone. Mostly. Till you run up against a guy like Dodger, a dealer with ties to Hansen. <sighs> try to warn him, but they never fucking listen. Just please try not to wipe Dodger's men. You'll make things go from bad to worse. Take this access card. Dodger took over an abandoned NCPD precinct. Security systems are still up and running, so this should get you in without a hitch. Upsides of last gen NCPD tech, huh? Save them. Please.
Christ's sake! There's a switch to the right. Use it! My right? Or your right? My fucking right! Hello? Who's asking, Charlie or Bill? It's Charlie. So Stella did manage to find someone. Thank fuck. Okay, let's try to get this open. Fucking slab this thing. A little help. Better step back. Jesus fucking Christ. I know. What the fuck? Don't worry. Not my blood. <laughs> the hell happened? Uh, better see for yourself. It's just through here. What in the... This is Bill. Hi. Who's your friend? Uh, who, me? Just told you, I I'm Bill. Thanks, Bill, got that. No, I mean the dead fucking body on the table you somehow failed to mention to Stella. We, we, we didn't kill him, okay? We, we, we swear. Let's see. Two blood-soaked dudes locked in a room with a gutted corpse. Yeah, real puzzler. Bet it'd take ages for a detective to unravel this one. Go on. Tell him about your genius idea. My idea? You're the one who set up the deal with was Dodger. rock fucking solid. If only you didn't leave a bag of drugs in front of a junkie. How was I supposed to know he'd swallow it? You say drugs? Oh, you go! No, you! I swear to fucking God. Went like this. Choom over here clips Dodger's shit. Hightails it to NC. We catch wind, Dodger's put out a bounty to bag him. Bring back his nose candy. Bump right into him during a routine stop. Dumb fucking luck. Choom was carrying seven ounces of Sin Coke. So we cuffed him. Took him here. Jim swallowed seven whole ounces? That, that even possible? So we're here, waiting on Dodger, when Bill pops the baggie on the table like it's nothing. All of a sudden, this gonk turd yells, Fuck you, pigs, and stuffs the bag in his mouth. Could have had a food tube implant? Like a deep, wide throat? Yeah, like the one your mom's got. Fuck you even talking about, Bill. Couldn't get him to just spit it out? We tried to make a trek oh tr track it tra fuck. Poke a fucking hole in his neck. No dice. Bag must have broke because he got all foamy at the mouth. Started spazzing out and then just croaked. That's when we started to panic. This fool gulped tens of thousands worth of eddies. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? If the bag already broke, why bother trying to play Operation? We panicked, all right? Shit happens. It's... It's all gone. Dissolved. And now Dodger's gonna end us. So you bring him the thief who swiped his dope. Only now there's no thief. Or dope. Yeah. It's about the gist of it. We gotta help us get out of here. All right, let's get moving. One last tiny thing. Came here in our squad car and, uh, kinda need it back. Just keeps getting better. Where is it? In the garage. To the garage we it's go. It's official, V. Finally made it to the major leagues. League of first-class leadheads, to be precise. Nice of you to join us, Johnny. Still Always value your input. Only if he finds out what we did. I'm a dead man walking. Know what you could use? What? A nice big pair of balls. Oh, because you're such a tough guy? Not like you stutter in front of the cap every fucking time. I don't fucking stutter. Let us through here before. What was the code again? 2893? 
It was 2983. Idiot, it was 2893. Saw him punch it. Go on. Didn't work. Ha! <laughs> 2983. I fucking told you. Dodger's goo. Careful. Shit, another door. It's sealed tight. Again? Come on, guys. Hey, this wasn't us, okay? Gotta be a switch around here somewhere. Dodger will drown us in eddies, Bill. The plan is foolproof, Bill. Trust me, I know what I'm saying, Bill. <sighs> Shut up, Bill. So what if it's fucking Pacifica? What, too pussy to set foot there, Bill? Afraid of earning some serious scratch? Says the asshole who couldn't keep a bag in his fucking pocket. Hey, shit, 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 shit! Sorry. You got it. They're coming! Do something! Sure.
squad cars right through here. You do have them, don't you? The keys. Shit. Wait, don't tell me you left them upstairs. Kill, Chum. Got them right here. Would you look at that? A welcoming party. How thoughtful. Greetings, fellas. Oh, am I early? We... Uh, we can explain. Quiet. You I don't know. Care to introduce yourself? Name's V. Got no clue what I'm doing here. Honest. I like that. One thing I can't put my finger on, though. What's that you got on your faces? A little ketchup? Run out of napkins? Uh... Yeah, well... Uh, no, not us. Per se. You any better at speaking full sentence? Uh, um... Uh, there was a shootout. A, a, a guy got hit. It was, was bleeding out fast. Uh, after that, brought your stuff here. Uh, left it all upstairs, so... It's all good. Another smooth talker. All right. Third time's a charm. Is he spinning yarns? It's all true. Happened exactly as Bill said. That's unfortunate. See, I really don't like being made a fool of. Boys. Oh, boy, you're uh. fuck now! Uh. Uh. Hey, where are the badges when you need them? Uh, yeah, right behind you. Is it over? Yup, nothing left but hop in your ride, flee the scene. Sure you can manage that much. Thanks. So are we going or what? Yeah, yeah. Hey. Thanks again. Okay. I'll radio us in. Tell him we're back. Wait. I'll get Stella on the hollow first. Maybe. V. So tell me. What did our boys in blue do this time? Swear to Christ, if someone asks me one more time... Prickly today, are we? I'll make do without details. If the client is happy, then so am I. Contract closed.
Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Green Steel. Certified resale. Capitan Caliente. Guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house by the looks of it. Right. Let's see what's here.
Oh, what's this? Antique. Junkie variety. I wonder if it even works. I'll have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Reed? Listen. Got no time to play games. Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flubbed the number. What the fuck do we do now? Call me V. Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Daytime. Noted. Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. Get your fresh clip shards here! Gonna take Jaden for the next gig. Why him? He a weak ass pussy. Yeah, but he's kinda hot. But no, thing is, he got some new something with Ronnie. Ronnie? Best seats in the house. Gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand. Basketball fan? That's new. You know what I mean. Everybody okay? Another game starting. One where your head's the fucking ball. Felt the same thing. Something nasty's brewing. Fucking storms, what's brewing? Don't let the sunshine fool you. You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians? Worse. Armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. No offense, but can we just chill a sec, watch the game some, enjoy just that. Why not? How about a hot dog and a cold beer while we're at it? Pretend we don't got a worry in the world. That will be so nice. Well, when you put it like that, fine. Savor it while it lasts. Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. Ah. Uh. Nope, no, -uh. don't do that. Just don't. So then, Johnny, who 
the hell's breathing down my neck? How the fuck should I know? Only see what you see. I see you holding something. Show me. Got this token. Mean anything to you? But I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who sent you? Don't know you. Don't work for you. So you can fuck off with the interrogation bullshit. Interrogation? We're just talking. Keep it cool, V. Let me ask you again. Who sent you? Mutual friend. We don't have mutual friends. Friend survived an accident. He might have heard. I might have. Zone defense, that. Keep pushing. Is she safe? Kid! Hard to say. The longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around him. Are you following? Did you even bother to check? Take me for a fucking gonk? An amateur? You sure fooled me. But fine. That I have to do. Black Thornton Merrimack. Let me stream. Three minutes. Front seat. We better leave separately. Don't want anyone to get suspicious. You first. Don't want to be caught holding hands? Reed? Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Bet he's got candy in that van. Ready to find out? Hey. You see the guy I was talking to a millisecond ago? Uh, big guy? Coat looking like he's planning on flashing some kids, huh? Hey! Shut it or get lost! Right scams installed, man. A Before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever risk so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Troon's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Odd introduction, but nice meeting you too, Reed. Not a phrase I often hear in this trade. You're not in the biz, V. Our biz. Actually, I am. Though, just since yesterday. 
I was about to say your first time's out are the hardest, but I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Freelance Merc. You were born in NC, Haywood. To make things more interesting, FIA agent. You received your commission last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Songbird hired me. Know her? Saw me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but... That girl's a magnet for trouble. Ray, it's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Just, uh, FYI. Not so sure you're gonna like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Damn straight, I don't like it. You left her alone? In Dogtown? Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Mm. Actually? Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last night I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob, he owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncer. Huh? That your Lilo gig? A bouncer? It pays the bills and nets me a little disposable. Sleeper agents aren't entitled to government pay. Not even under the table. Huh. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? Snitches get stitches, man. Well, that'll be a yes. Not good. When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. This is the place. Eight floor. Yeah. Lead the way. Honestly? This is not inspiring confidence. She's capable of taking care of herself, you know. I actually had uninvited guests last night. Ejected via the garbage chute. Sometimes that's the only way out. If anyone had tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Take point. Open up, it's me. Is this how you greet me? Uh... Sorry. Roslyn, are you all right? I'm good. Glad to see you are too. Hmm. You 
remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Level with me, Roslyn. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Here. The president, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh-huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. So, the cast of Hawks squawking for war. For some, the war never ended. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard so me was on board. Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. She was coordinating our escape, guiding us. Something happened mid-op. Elaborate. Like she was attacked. I don't know, hard to describe. Whatever the case, it's fucking bad news. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... Uh, bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? What do you mean, already died? What has my eyes told you about me? Said you led an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arasaka tried to smoke me. <clears throat> and that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Huh. Might have slipped her mind. Convenient. Well, now you know. Look, every moment we spend pouting here, our chances of finding Somi alive drop. Hard. Barely know you, but you don't seem like a chum who'd leave their agent out to dry. She won't survive without backup. Don't know me well, but well enough, I guess. I wouldn't. I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi. And my country. Call me naive if you like. As for you, V, you said in the car a songbird hired you, correct? I don't know how much she's paying, but you better ask yourself, is it worth it? Songbird's my only shot at surviving. Got Arasaka's relic in my head, slowly, surely poaching my brain. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Agreed. Think so, too. If we want to find Somi, we gotta dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing, who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. Big ask in Dogtown. Won't be easy. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks. For everything.
stay safe. And don't let the bastards get you. Same to you, V. May we meet again in more favorable circumstances. All right, I need to make some calls. Functional. Pipes seem bad, lands dry. Wonder where they lead. Something's off. We gotta try to get the boys. Ow! You're the one who keeps pestering people. 